A boat trip in the Maldives is really cool because you can explore a ton of atolls and look for different kinds of waves. There are a lot of reef passes and they all have a ton of potential. We were looking for the spots that were picking up the most swell and had no one around. If the wind is bad on one side of the island, the other side is good. When we got on the boat, we met the other families for the first time. The boat brought everyone together because you spend lots of time hanging out when you're not surfing and when you spent a lot of time in the water. The Maldives is a bunch of atolls in the middle of the Indian Ocean. Being able to check this part of that world out is definitely a bucket list kind of trip. There was a lot of cool stuff to do and check out, even when we weren't surfing. Getting to meet the other kids and spend a lot of time on the boat and surfing all day was really fun. We all became good friends right away. It was sick paddling back out after a wave and seeing your friend get absolutely barreled. We were all stoked to surf and it was awesome vibe in the water. One of the days we woke up early and no one else was awake. We took the ski to another wave just down the reef and it was a really fun sunrise session. This wave is a trip. It starts off super friendly and shreddable, then goes into a shallow end section. This morning was pretty low tide, so the reef was very dry on the inside. 
That's one of the cool things about being on a boat trip. When we least expected, I had a really fun session with no one around. It was kind of sketchy, but definitely a highlight of the trip. to do another boat trip in the future. Living and surfing on a boat is really sick.